Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jay. I film vlogs and lifestyle content here on YouTube. Make sure y'all hit that subscribe button and don't forget to turn the post notifications on so you know every time a real nigga post, period. I'm sorry, I know I look crazy. I'm in the middle of washing my hair right now. I deleted some footage on accident of me doing an intro to the video, so I had to do it over. So to start this vlog off, I do need to go to pick up some things for my dog. So y'all are gonna see me go to the pet store starting now. We here with it, y'all. Bozy, always, always Bozy. Okay. I always have so much stuff in my damn hands. So, this is his food. This is what he eats for right now. It's puppy food because he is a puppy. He ain't grown yet, so he gotta eat this till he get grown. Let's go get his treats, because I think they're over here. He has like a specific everything. Yes, these right here is his treats. This guy has every toy. I don't know what to get him. 17. Who? Oh Lord have mercy. $17 for him to mess something up. Alright, let me get him a donut. Last time I got him the cheeseburger. Let me get him the donut. Yeah, that's cute and it's cheap. When I tell y'all poop bags are expensive, y'all want to know how expensive it is to pick up shit? Look at them prices. $7, $11, $13, $20. This one is $22. It's expensive to pick up shit. Oh my God. I practically live in this goddamn store. I be here at least twice a week. Got everything. Got the food. Got the treats. Got the toy. And got the poop bags. $43.69. Alright, y'all. I got everything that I needed. Now it's time to go home. My family want me to cook. I don't know if I have it in me, but I'm gonna try. And I have to wash my hair too. Shit. I don't know if I can do all that. There ain't no superwoman. Lock that up. Y'all see how fast I locked that after I closed the door? I don't play that. Okay, I'm back, my popular demand. I hate how these masks be taking my fucking lip gloss off. So right now I'm about to head home. Hopefully I have it in me to cook and do my hair and edit my video, I don't know. I'ma see y'all when we get back to the crib, per. All right, y'all, so I just got back to the crib and I am about to wash my hair. I thought I was gonna be cooking for my family, but everybody went to bed, so that must mean they ain't hungry, right? Hi, Tinky Baby. Hi, Tinky Baby. There you go, baby. Say hi to the vlog. Say hi to the vlog, baby. Get, get the, did I give that to you yet? No, sit down. Hey y'all, so right now I'm in the kitchen. Yes, I wash my hair in the kitchen sink. That's how I grew up. That probably ain't never gonna change. Listen baby, my hair is way too thick to be washing it in anybody's tub or shower. Like, my hair stops that shit up, so I have to do it in the sink. This is what I use on my hair. I don't use nothing different. It's this every time, Ozzy Moist, the avocado one. And it works wonders on my hair. I wash my hair in halves. My hair is really, really thick. So, I have to wash it like in two parts. Okay, y'all. So, I'm going to start off with this side of my head. And I'm going to try my best to show y'all. But I'm probably going to go into voiceover mode right now because I'm about to watch my YouTube videos. No shade. All right, y'all. So, first, I'm starting out by washing the sink because I'm not about to stick my head in no dirty-ass sink that had mad food and shit in it. So, I'm just scrubbing it clean, making sure it's good. And then next, I am just getting all the buildup out of my hair. So, like, I'm just rinsing out all the gel, the edge control oils out of my hair. I'm just trying to get everything out and make sure my hair is nice and clean before I go in and wash it. So, then I'm taking a shampoo. I take about four pumps. And then I'm just working that into the hair, making sure I'm scrubbing my scalp. <music> Now I'm just rinsing the shampoo out of my hair. And it took me a while to do this because my hair kind of thick. So, just like me. <laughs> now I'm taking my conditioner and I'm putting that in my hair. Just working that through. I'm not scrubbing this in. You don't scrub conditioner into your hair. You moisturize the hair strands. I should just be a natural hair. You, never mind. It don't even matter. 
Now I am just sectioning my hair. So I washed and conditioned one side of my hair. Now it's time to do the other side. Girl, if you don't get, they see your hair, girl. They see your hair, they get it, uglass. So now I'm just doing the same exact process to the other side of my hair, starting with removing the gunk and all of that stuff in my hair. And y'all can see like a little bit better here. Y'all can see all the buildup coming out of my hair from all that gel and edge control. So after everything is washed and conditioned, I'm just gonna section my hair into four parts because that's what makes it easier for me to actually detangle my hair. And then I'm gonna go in with a paddle brush and I'm actually gonna detangle all of the different sections. my hair is detangled I'm gonna go ahead and rinse the conditioner out and I always rinse with cold water the last time I got my hair straightened the hairstylist told me this she said it's really good to rinse out your deep conditioners or your regular conditioners with cold water Now that my whole entire head is washed and conditioned, I'm gonna put it in a ponytail to the back and then I'm going to take a t-shirt and I'm just gonna put that on my head. I like to use a t-shirt instead of a towel because a towel really just rips your hair out. Who the hell? Oh, that's my grandma, we good. <laughs> she scared the hell out of me. <laughs> this was like 12 a.m., I thought everybody was asleep. So now that I'm done washing my hair, I'm gonna wash the sink out again. Everything needs to be washed and cleaned properly before and after. Okay y'all, so now we back in my room and I'm just gonna show y'all what my hair looks like after it's fully washed. And it just looks beautiful, healthy. Ah, girl, you look good and you know it. So now I'm just gonna section my hair off into fours again and I'm actually gonna start doing my twist out. Now I already filmed a video on how I do my twist out so make sure y'all head over to my channel and go watch that if you wanna know how I take care of my natural hair, how I twist it up, how I give voluptuous curls, you know? So y'all can go check that out instead of me explaining what I'm doing again. It's a whole video on that girl. First, I take my oil sheen, spray a little bit of that. Then I take my curling creams. I do the Shea Moisture Curl Enhancing Smoothie and the Shea Moisture Curl Gel Souffle, I think it's called. Then I just work those onto the section that I'm about to twist. And then I also take the foam lotion, I think it's called. It's also by Shea Moisture as well. These are all the orange labels, so you'll be able to find them easily. And then I just start twisting. I just start twisting down, watching my little YouTube videos. And then I make sure at the ends, I twirl a little curl around on the end so I can have a little curl when I take the twist out down. And it's that simple. But like I said, I have a video on it. So if you wanna know more information, just go check that out. Okay y'all, so I just finished my hair and I have my bonnet on now, but I put all the twists into a ponytail. When I put it in a ponytail like this, it stretches the twists out so that my hair appears longer. Your girl just got a cut, so I have to make it kind of look 
longer than what it is. Right now, I am about to roll up and go to bed. And I also have to walk Brooklyn. So while I walk Brooklyn, I'm gonna smoke and then I'm gonna come back in, watch YouTube videos till I knock and then get ready for tomorrow. This is what I be doing on the weekdays. I usually only vlog on the weekends, but the weekdays are a lot more busier. So I was like, maybe I should try to vlog on the weekdays too. So y'all can kinda, you know, see what the girl be doing during the week. Yeah. Thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to turn the post notifications on so that you know every time a real nigga like me drop a video. Period. Bye y'all. See y'all in the next one.